Hi guys, what's up, Jason here, and welcome back to a brand new FIFA 18 player review on my channel. So in today's video, guys, I'm going to be reviewing 81 rated SBC Asuma Asayidi. Now this card, looking at it, is a very, very good. Got some really nice pace stats, some really nice dribbling stats, and decent shooting. He's got the 5-star skill moves and the 4-star weak foot. So now moving into the in-game stats, as you can see, he's got the 88 acceleration, the 88 sprint speed, the 93 agility, what in my opinion is his standout stat, and then he does also have 85 dribbling. So just, you know, in the pace and dribbling card, when it comes down to skilling, as you would expect, this card is going to be very good already. So guys, this has been the in-game stats, now let's get into the highlights. So now moving into the highlights, the first pro I could find on this card was his dribbling. Now Asayadi has a really really cool dribbling, he keeps it very close to his feet and he's also very composed on the ball, doesn't really panic or take heavy touches, he always keeps it really close to his feet, especially in tight spaces as well, where he's very helpful, especially there, as you can see he's surrounded by loads of players in the box, but he manages to use the skill moves um, and manages to finish it off very very nicely. After that the next pro I could find on this card was his 93 agility, and that is also his key stat, as you always say agility is the best stat when it comes down to scaling and this guy has 93 so it's basically um, once you do apply a chem style to him he goes up to around the 99 chem um, 99 um, agility mark so this guy basically is one of the best skillers and he's just so smooth when performing skill moves um, one thing I did find with this card was he was very consistent at ball roll step over combos what I really liked about him and he was also very fast when performing the skill moves so he re reminded me a lot of Neymar um, just not as good um, the next pro I could find this card was his stamina the nurse guy he has around 80 stamina so it doesn't really seem that good but um, in matches you never really seem to get tired or anything um, what was good so it means you can still skill all game um, without getting tired and now now moving on into the pros I'm sorry the cons the first con I could from this card was his finishing now this guy wasn't very clinical in front of goal um, he would have scored a lot more goals in the matches if he could have just finished a little bit better um, I wanted some really nice score runs um, but some of them I just couldn't finish them off and then the final con I could from this card was his strength now, now this guy is a very weak player, um, similar to Neymar, similar to you know other five star skillers, just very weak, gets pushed off the ball very easily and he's probably one of the weakest players I've used, I think he's only got around 50 strength as well so he can't really hold his own weight so that's one thing you really do need to look out for. Um, the other thing I wanted to talk about was my channel consistency. Now I haven't really been uploading too often compared to you know I used to upload daily or every other day but now I've been uploading around once to two times a week and the main reason is just because you know FIFA in my opinion is just completely dead now and I don't really enjoy playing the game like it's not exactly boring for me but it's just not as fun as it used to be and I don't really have too much motivation to you know make videos um, so I'm just going to be trying to upload maybe one or two videos a week and try and put in a bit more effort into them and I'm going to be sort of experimenting with uh, videos um, I've got a Ben Arthur review coming out after this but after that I'm going to probably start you know mixing the videos up a bit but anyway guys that has been the highlights and now let's get into the overview so starting off the overview, we're going to move on to the enjoyment scale. Now I decided to give him an eight point, um, sorry, an eight out of ten when it comes down to enjoyment. The reason it isn't any higher is just because um, when playing with this card, you just get pushed off the ball quite a lot, and it can be really frustrating. So that's why it's only an eight out of ten, not a nine out of ten, or even a ten out of ten. Competitiveness-wise, I'm only going to give him a six out of ten. And again, this card is good for skilling, good for dribbling, but everything else is pretty bad. You know, really weak, not really the greatest shooting. He has decent shot power um, and decent long shots but his finishing is very bad and when you do play foot champs you want you know these clinical players and again his passing and crossing isn't really the best at 72 scaling wise though as I've already said very very good I'm going to give him an 8.5 out of 10 and then I'm going to give him an overall rating of an 8 out of 10 so guys if you have enjoyed this video and want to see more FIFA 18 player reviews on my channel don't forget to leave a like on the video and subscribe thanks for watching and see you next time